everybody. Happy Wednesday. Today is April 3rd, 2019. I'm Lorenzo Spadero. And I'm Blake Hutchison. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and the Face Pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We at Pace pledge to everybody with <laughs> fairness, kindness, and respect. You know, after we graduate, we're going to have to cook all our own meals. I know. I got all these recipes shoved into my drawer. Me too. Maybe Jocelyn will have a helpful idea in O Organization. Welcome back to another episode of O Organization. Today, we'll be talking about how to organize your recipes. You will need an empty binder, a pack of unlabeled tabs, and your recipes. Start off by making the first page your table of contents. Next, by using the labels tabs to label your recipes. Then, add the recipes in the binder. And there you have a wonderful recipe book. Thanks for watching. If your parents are looking forward to gala coming up on Saturday, they're probably curious about what they can bid on. Here's a promo to show you some of the items. Ice cream, ice cream, ice cream with toppings can be yours and five other friends with Miss Namie, Miss Thompson, and Miss Collie. Our support sessions for the science fair with Ms. McDaniel. Gluten free peanut butter chocolate cake with peanut butter buttercream and chocolate ganache from Mr. Rubin. Do you need help on the SAT or ACT? You can win five hours of math tutoring with Mr. Rubin. Do you like cheesecake? What about muffins? Well, both can be yours, any kind, any flavor, and they'll be baked by Miss Frost. Hey, do you like tacos? Absolutely, that's my favorite food. You and your friends should come and join us. Come and join Miss Grant and I for Taco Tuesday. All you have to do is bid on it at the gala. Join the elementary team for a pirate PJ party here at school. Cook a meal with Mr. Weitzner and Miss Grimm. A gift from the heart from myself, Miss Nisbell, and Miss LaFuente is a movie in my room with snacks. Have you ever wanted to be on PNN and go behind the scenes? We're giving one elementary or middle school student the opportunity to be anchor for the day and find out everything that you need to know about PNN. You could be a star. Now it's time to send things over to our fellow senior Brendan Winship. My name is Brendan Winship, and welcome back to Political Travels. In an update to the Boeing jet crash in Ethiopia, officials examining the wreckage have learned that a flight control device activated before the jet crashed. The purpose of this device is to prevent the plane from stalling. As the investigation is still continuing, Boeing has declined to give a comment. In other news, U.S. President Trump announces that he wants to wait until after the 2020 election to replace the Affordable Care Act. This decision is the opposite of what the president said he would do last week, which was to quickly scrap the act. It is unclear what the Affordable Care Act would be replaced with. If this law is abolished, at least 20 million people will lose health care coverage. That's all for this time. Make sure to stop by next week for more political travels. Time to wrap up the show with the White Dove Award winners. And the quote of the day. The best preparation for tomorrow is doing your best today. H. Jackson Brown Jr. Good luck with all those continuing testing. Let's make it a great day.